since the passing of the Constitution, there have been vigorous debates on what constitutes what Hamilton was calling energy or strength in the executive branch. Usually, the party that's out of power argues that the executive branch is too strong, and the party that's in power thinks the executive branch is too weak. So Hamilton argues that, look, since the United States president, unlike the English king, can be censored or booted from office at the next election, and it's not that far away, or even removed from office before the next election if, his, if he's impeachable, you can impeach him, and that punishment mechanism is sufficient. So the pros outweigh the cons. The strong executive branch has its weaknesses. It creates a bunch of room for a divided nation, just like we have right now.